You wanna be at the top? Inshallah. Are we the cream of the crop? Inshallah. You gotta rock till you drop. Inshallah. Cause believers never stop. Yeah. Mashallah. Come on. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. This is Naeem Muhammad here at the Mass ICNA Convention, Chicago, Illinois. Here at the convention, once again, at the Dean TV studios, always on, always live. And um, I have an uh, excellent guest here. And all weekend, we're at the convention and we're meeting artists, we're meeting community activists, we're meeting even YouTubers. And we're uh, meeting a YouTuber right now. What is your name again, brother? Uh, Ali Nafa. Ali Nafa, and um, you were telling me you have a you have a YouTube channel and um, for health and wellness, correct? Yes, I do. I have a YouTube channel. I have more than eight thousand subscribers in just few months. Excellent, and, excellent. Yeah, they're on the rise. So what? So um, what do you? What do you? How do you get? How did you get started with your YouTube channel? What do you? What do you do? What do you talk about in particular on your channel? Uh, I have uh, personal experience in um, uh, losing losing weight. I was at okay. two hundred and sixty pounds. That okay. I had. A uh, bunch of health issues, and uh, I started eating healthy, and uh, I lost weight. I got rid of my um, health issues, and then I started helping others, awesome. and uh, I found that it works. Then I, I thought about taking it to the internet, to the world. So, what, what, okay, so excellent, and that's so great. Like taking your life experience and then sharing. That's one thing I I talk about. What's amazing about the YouTube community is how much sharing that people do and, and when people are looking for resources so how 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 did your life change what things did you change in your life you said you were to get rid of this weight this new lifestyle what, did, what things did you change um, I changed actually three things the first thing I that I changed is um, what I eat okay and then the eating habits how I eat okay like then give the me physical an activities give me an example um, Regarding the changing the what I eat is I, I I stopped all the processed food. Okay. Actually, I came to a decision that I'm not gonna eat any processed food anymore. I took okay. all the processed food in my pantry. I threw it in the garbage. Okay. And then I started. Processed I, food like the macaroni and cheese, the what else? Like the cookies, the cakes, all those type of things. Yeah, all of that. Anything has that has been manufactured. Anything in a package. Anything that has more than one. Uh, components. So I eat na natural food. I eat okay. uh, fruits, vegetables, seeds and nuts, um, beans, um, some some meat, some dairy products. Okay. Uh, I eat food the way uh, it's picked up from the ground, okay. the way that Allah Subhanahu wa Taala created for okay. us, not the way that the from so that the, the food industry wants us to not consume. this chemical experiment of food that they have us in involved with the processed food. Yeah. And, and what about activities? Now you also say you also added. A activity. I mean, you just working out, or even beyond that. What, what are you doing there? Yeah, I, I started only by just walking for about half hour, okay, to one hour every day. Okay, uh, that's what I started with. Now I do weightlifting, okay. but I lost all my weight almost uh, with just uh, changing the eating habits, the uh, changing the diet, and then doing mild physical activity. Oh, awesome! Awesome. It doesn't need all. I mean, some people think that it is like very challenging and it's very difficult. And yes, it is challenging at the beginning, but once you uh, once you start and once you establish habits, it's going to become very, very, very easy. And how long did you see, like, how long before, how long did it take you to get beyond that you were, you know, that you were seeing the results and stuff like that to, to really push you forward? What, what kept pushing you forward to do this? Like, when it got too much, when it got too, you know, I, I'm just going to have a cheeseburger, I'm just going to have... You know these things what what drove you to keep going uh, you know the first thing is knowledge I mean to understand that all processed food I mean processed food are mostly they're they're not food actually okay. if you're if you're just eating um, things that are full of coloring agents flavoring agents preservatives all of that those are food like substances okay those are not food what makes you healthy is to consume real food okay uh mostly fru fruits and vegetables and you will feel it you will feel the difference you will i mean you will start losing weight uh you'll uh, if you have some people like have mood swings they start getting rid of that uh actually fruits and vegetables are full of uh, vitamins and minerals that our body need hmm. so we don't eat only to just fill our stomach 
or to just get calories. Okay. Uh, we eat to get energy. We eat to get the vitamins and minerals that our body need, and those are all in natural food. Yeah, there's a famous book I think it's called "Eat to Live." You know, eat to live and 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 the lifestyle. So. Um, if you had like one, if you if you were telling your your viewers and and how did you build? How did you start to go on this path? Did you design it yourself? You just came to your own understanding, or you researched and then that's how you started to change all these things like your diet and your activities. Uh, yes, I, I did. I did uh, uh, in depth research. Actually, I, I read multiple books and I listened to multiple audio books. I listened to multiple lectures. I took courses. I actually enrolled in the largest nutrition school in the world the, the Institute of Integrative Nutrition okay. but I, I'm telling everybody that you don't need to do that right. it's just very easy if you start if you stop processed food and you eat natural natural food if you start eating less and there are techniques for that and there are habits to establish we can talk about it if you'd like okay. uh, if, and you to yeah, do give, some physical give, give me one example uh, one, one of your techniques oh uh, okay I'll, I'll I'll give you one of them one of the, one one of the, of the secret the, techniques that you know you that you tell all your subscribers I, I'll talk to you about one of the eating habits it's very life-changing um, so many people I mean most people eat quickly swallow food like quickly right and they don't and, shoot and wish, well. And I wish Abdul Malik, our, in our band Native Dean, Abdul Malik, he's like, by the time that me and Joshua sit down and get our plate ready, he's like already finished. But he <laughs> works out a lot, so he's he's good. Yeah, but but go ahead, you tell me. Yeah. So uh, the point is to chew food about 20 to 25 times. Okay. It's it uh, it may sound difficult at the beginning. You can yeah you will need to count the first couple of days or a few days. Then it's it's gonna become a habit. And the point uh, that you, you need to chew your food 20 to 25 times or more, uh, three reasons actually. The first one is when you chew your food, you make it, uh, you, you make it easy to digest for your stomach. Right. So you digest it well. The second is actually digestion uh, starts in the mouth, okay. not in the stomach. So there are enzymes in the saliva that uh, starts the digestion and converting some uh, um, some uh, components in the food, uh, the, um, the, like the amylase enzymes, for example. Okay. It, it starts breaking sugar in the mouth, so you start the digestion process in mouth. So when you eat quickly, you don't do full digestion. Uh, the, uh, the third point is to enjoy your food. Okay. Uh, because when you, I mean, I ask people this question, and it's like. It, it makes people like change their mind like uh, immediately I ask them when do you enjoy your food when you uh, when it's in your mouth or, or when it and, and it's in your stomach yeah, yeah and they say it's when it's in my mouth I don't enjoy it any, anymore when it's in my stomach right then I ask them then uh, how would you enjoy your food more and the answer is to keep it in your mouth as long as, as you long can as by chewing it as Savor it. yeah Savor as much it. as you can Okay. And so you enjoy your food more, and that, that's actually one of the reasons we eat. We eat to satisfy our hunger, and we eat to enjoy our food. But people, most people get it wrong, so they want to enjoy their food, so they eat quickly and they eat more. No, if you want to enjoy your food, eat uh, slowly, chew your food, so you will enjoy it more. And actually, you will eat less and enjoy your food more. Awesome, awesome. All right, so if people want to learn more, they want to join your 8,000 subscribers, on YouTube, how would they find you on YouTube? Um, uh, my, the, the, my, my channel that has 8,000 subscriber now is in Arabic. It's uh, it's, it's called Ish uh, Hayatak, Live Your Life. So if they look up Ish Hayatak Ali Nafi in Arabic, they will find it. I have another channel. Uh, I have another cha channel in English. Uh, it's uh, uh, it's uh, uh, it's Ali Nafi World Ali Nafi dash world w o r r l d and i put only one uh, one video right now uh, okay. right now for my son but uh, i'm gonna add more videos so okay. they well, can find it well uh, i mean at dean tv we have people subscribing around the world who are arabic speakers and, and the like and um we will love to try to to um get this message out and and to see and we hope you invite them to dean tv yeah, i'm gonna sure. look more into this thing about um, decreasing, you know, those processed foods because it's something I, I want to reduce. I want to get a little more fit. For I a can while, help you with that. For a while, I was doing like uh, I was vegetarian or uh, pescatarian for three years, um, and then I fell off the wagon. 
but um, but uh, it's something that I'm trying to work on to have better eating habits and and, and whatever. Yeah, actually, so, I've helped many people. I I, I have uh, I'm a health coach, so I do health coaching, and uh, I mean, many people just lost about like they start uh, losing like seven pounds or ten pounds okay. from the first couple of weeks. Okay. And uh, for the English Channel, uh, just to uh, remind uh, the viewers, if you look up the youngest health coach ever. So that's a video for my son. He's, okay. He was he, he just recorded a video really? like he's a health coach. So even the that's whole family is involved in this. That's <laughs> yeah, actually, and and that's a beauty of that. When you start start eating healthy, it starts changing your life. I mean, you, your family is gonna start to change, and okay. uh, you're gonna start to change people around you. Okay. Excellent. Thank you again for your time here. Like I said, I'm gonna look more into your channel, and um, I really appreciate your time, and good luck with everything that you're okay. doing. Thank like you. Him. Nice to see you. All right, and thanks, ag thanks again for watching Dean TV. Always on, always live. Thank you. The video was made possible in part by Islamic Relief USA, working together for a better world. By Guidance Residential, the number one Islamic home financer in the U.S. And by Recycle Processes Incorporated.